Technology now allows for a new way for medical help to be sent to you in an emergency. ABC 10 News Now senior reporter Mike Hoey has a look for us at how this new system works. The Upper Peninsula 911 Authority bought a computer-aided dispatch system last year. For the last 10 months, emergency medical service agencies in the 10 counties covered by the 911 Authority have had the option of being dispatched on service calls by receiving texts. Marquette County is one of those areas. The majority of our volunteer agencies are making use of it along with our volunteer fire and even the full-time fire. Uh, it is less useful to the full-time EMS as uh, they're on duty and ready to respond uh, at, at, a, at a moment's notice. Most of EMS in the Upper Peninsula is provided by volunteers and anything we can do to give them more resources is going to be better because they do a, a fantastic job and they need help and this is just another technology that can help them help others. Once the dispatcher types and sends the message, all personnel with the receiving agency will have written information in front of them about where they need to go and what type of call it is. I've heard that the EMS people appreciate it. It gives them extra information that they can use, and if it helps them get somewhere quicker, it's better. This is an 800 megahertz radio. Now a text can't take the place of one of these, but it can do some things that one of these radios would have a hard time with. Some people might be with their radio and they're out of their range of where they would be. And so if they don't get the radio signal, they can get the telephone signal on there as a message to see that they're needed somewhere. We can go uh, agency specific or um, for all responders. If there's a, a red flag warning by the DNR for fire danger uh, for a particular day, we can let all the firefighters in the county know that. Johnson says Central Dispatch is developing a policy with law enforcement agencies about active shooter situations, such as in a school. The system is capable of texting all off-duty police officers in the county and asking them to respond. Mike Hoey, ABC 10 and CW5 News Now.